Hello everyone, Baseball Caniac here, and it's time for episode 2 of Baseball Plays Mario Kart Wii, so let's get right back to it. Stay with Luigi. We'll keep the car we got, because it's been working so well. Start off with... These are the retro cuts. The first one in Shell Cup 50cc is Peach Beach from the GameCube. Now there was a there was a shortcut in this track in the GameCube version, but as you can see on the wall back there, it's been closed off. So I'll use this one to make up for it. Oh boy, Cataquax. Cataquax are super smart in this one. And they are fast as all get out. Fast as grease lightning. Seed and then go with it. Take it away from that guy. Well, thankfully, they're all uh, temporarily stuck in the ground. Boy, those things are just relentless in this, in this game. I don't remember a link that pursue it in the GameCube. Let's go out this way. But we all need mushrooms because we have the water receding at a very good pace. will be the Nintendo DS Yoshi Falls. Do not go on those waterfalls unless you have a mushroom. It will not work. Or if you're just incredibly good at mini turbo. This is a very tiny track, so this race isn't going to take long at all. In fact, I think it's the shortest race track in the game. Thankfully I stopped on the booster so I can still get a boost from it. 
Yoshi was giving me a little scare, so it's Mario, but we got it. So as long as you say patient, you should have no trouble with it. some shortcuts here that I might not be able to showcase them. We just passed it where you can skip a nice portion of the track. Retro speed booster there. I'm pretty sure the game says either Game Boy Advance or SNES. There it is. You just jump on that little ramp. And then you end up over here. And those guys are really creeping me out. <laughs> this is also a very short track. I just didn't realize it until now. This might actually be shorter than the other one. Every time I think I know something, I'm pretty wrong later. Woo, I just made a block fall down. That's not good. So I didn't get to use the shortcut. But all I would have done is jump from there to here. I don't know that. There's not really much here. But whoa. Whoa. You slow down a little bit. Didn't make a difference. Alright, so this might be the shortest track. Don't quote me. Uh, might be long again. So finally we have probably my favorite retro track of this game, Mario Raceway from N64 with updated graphics. Isn't that lovely? Already they trying to hit me. Got the Koopa cart. The updated piranha plants are a nice touch. Those things just looked weird in <laughs> the N64. I couldn't tell what they were. They didn't really have any teeth. They just look like a bunch of sucking on mushrooms. Couldn't tell what they were. And even the pipe ton was upgraded. Tunnel vision. And there didn't used to be a shine sprite there. Just a real nice track to cut your teeth on. Just a nice little wire fence up there. And of course, that's also been updated. To go! The Mario looks better. Thanks for taking that banana out, whoever did that. You're the real MVP. The real MVP. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tick somebody off of those fake items. And a banana. No one's going to hit him. Oh, that's well, the way it goes. Mario's hat is up there, by the way. And it looks up there. Okay, now somebody took one out. That might be a cool path. But now I can litter the track as much as I want to, because I won't be making another trip through here.
Just get through these trees. With that nice pattern on them, look like bumblebee stingers. Nothing left here, little banana. Let's do it that way. Ah, I missed it. Well, please don't come back and hit me. By the way, that's not a camera effect, that's actually on the game, that little ray of sunshine you saw. There was another point in the video, I think last video I should have pointed that out. Sometimes the sun's rays will try to hit you and it looks realistic. To where the sun's rays are hitting in such a way it'll make a circle on the camera lens. But don't worry, that's not me, that's the game. And another two star rank and a shell cup gold trophy. So let's move right along and go to what I think is the Banana Cup. And yes it is. The nostalgia continues with N64 Sherbet Land. I'm glad the penguins are defined. No more, no more polygon looking penguins in the first. In the first time this track was represented. Bottom of the slice of life. For the first time in this series, mushrooms. I haven't seen too many of them. Let's see if I have a chance to do it. And they've made this next part eerie, which I'm not understanding why. Let's listen to that. that sun glare again. In the GameCube, there is a way to avoid the slimy shell, it's just difficult. If you could get into a cannon and blast off before it hits you, it would disappear and it wouldn't, it wouldn't respawn again. It would just despawn after getting to you and not hitting. This one though, I think they patched that. Ah, oh, I missed. Missed a curve, but I think I'm still going to win. That can happen if you're not going fast enough and whatnot. This time we're gonna go this way. You have the rest of the circuit to make that up. I think I got all of Ouija. Should I end it the cool way? Yeah, I 
think I will. It's time for Luigi to cool off. Whoosh. Ah, I maintained it. <sighs> I was trying to dive into the water. Oh, Luigi, you ruined my swag finish. Oh well. Point is, we won, and we're moving on. This is Game Boy Advance Shy Guy Beach, so if you played Super Circuit, you'll remember this one. Kind of a frustrating track. Because that Shy Guy pirate ship is going to be casting bombs the whole time, and you just don't know where to land, and you gotta dodge them quick. I instantly regret shooting that shot. Let's go this way because there's a Stay focused here and avoid the crowds. Delfino Square. And I think it looks better on this version than it did on that.
sent them along. Try to save that green shell for when you need it. But it would be nice to have a second one, so I'll go ahead and use it now. I'll see how it ends again, I will. There we go. And that was useless. I might not be that I'd take that shortcut after all. To be honest, it's not a really good one. That just leads you out to here. And while it is useful, it's only really useful if you have a mushroom or a star. Other than that, it's just painful. And even if you have the right things, you could fall into the water. So be advised. Shortcut's good, but if you're not quick on turning, you'll just land in the water. Final race of the Banana Cup is Waluigi Stadium. From the GameCube, the nice little dirt track from Wario Stadium. In the 64. Sometimes the throttle plants are glitched and that they don't bite, but this time they are biting. Thankfully those are all real plants. Ow! 
cuts to go. Just skip all this. The banana cup. Another two star. I've unlocked the leaf cup. Start this one out with DS Desert Kills, which looks like it was ripped out of Super Mario 3. As you can tell by the girders, the angry sun, that's terrifying. And the bricks. This one you really enjoy. I mean, look at the Mario 3 references, they're all over the place. That sun will do damage to you if you're not careful. He will shoot fireballs from the sky. Oh, okay, this is not starting well. <laughs> trying to commentate here. It's not letting me. This is the, this is the rockiest start I've had in the race. Took my out of the box. Ooh. Dang it, baby Peach, get out of the way. And here comes Bowser. His giant rig. Just a banana. Not what I need in second place. And for the first time, I'm trailing at the end of a lap. I could just get past Bowser, but he's really racing well here. Here we go. Get on to the inside. Lightning strikes twice. Just can't escape. what I needed. So many bananas. Waiting on that sun to spew out another fire snake. That was a pound block. I didn't know what was happening. I wasn't paying attention. I was trying to get that mushroom, and I did. So much stuff is happening. Oh, whoa! Hard time the board. Little mushroom. Couldn't take the shortcut with it, but there we go. Oh, he disappeared before I could hit him. That was an accident, but that wouldn't have funny. So wouldn't have felt it. He would have disintegrated the thing, if anything. Show. One, two, three, and four. Dangerous is right. So many dangerous elements there.
Anyway, let's move on to the next track in the Retro series. And that is GBA Bowser Castle 3. Mm. I forgot all about this one. This is my second favorite. The Iron Man. Actually, let's just say this one in Mario Raceway 64 time. I mean, both of these are just too good. Of course, the blunts here are a lot more active. That was quick. Litter some items around here. Give this track some stuff to grind on. This, this is a long track. You, you lose track. You lose sight of how long it is because to see all the design here. I mean, it's a really well designed track, I think. And you don't even notice sometimes you're racing on a on an iron wire net. <laughs> How do the wheels go off? I don't know. Try not to question Nintendo logic too much. Besides, if you play enough Mario games, this will be the least of your concerns. I could have made that, but I didn't want to chance it. I thought the thwomp was coming down faster than it was. See if we can make all these jumps. Whoa. Thankfully we still got propelled without a lot of momentum. So that wasn't a problem. At least once. Escape the slimy shell. Not in this game, they've made it OP. I just clipped it. There are so many bananas here, why not leave one more? Have a bunch of bananas. Literally. Now we just got one more round of these jumps. over there. Oh, I actually jumped over the plump. That's pretty exciting. Wasn't enough to go with the grain. That is Bowser's Castle 3 Game Boy Advance. Wow. Had a baby peach and baby daisy. Or the way you said. Baby daisy. Nintendo 64, DK's Jun Donkey Kong's Jungle Parkway. Oosh. Got that old stuff with that old school speed boost. You can't uh, do a trick in midair for that one. Just drive and try and try and just doesn't happen. 
speed boost in this track incidentally. So unless I somehow get a mushroom, which I don't think uh, has a small chance I think in first place. Just have to wait for it to subside. Third lap's got the green shells and the bananas. Maybe a red shell every now and then. Thankfully, we still got the speed boost. If I had gotten it fast enough, I would have been able to skip it. What's up, guys? <laughs> I think that scared them a little bit more. Uh, Nintendo logic is a thing. We're almost done with the retro series. So next time it'll be 100 cubic centimeters, hopefully. Good. If you had a star or a mushroom, you could just zoom right up this hill. And now the last track of the Leaf Cup. GameCube Mario Circuit. GameCube, Nintendo, Mario Circuit, GCM, Mario Circuit. Castle looks a little different on this one. That sign says shoot. With a red shell on it. Just 
dodge these piranha plants here. close to the end here. Another two star. Lightning cup and the super looper. Legitimate looking Grand Prix course. Mario Circuit 3 for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System. There is a shortcut here if I'm not going to use it. There it is, you just go right through that hole there. Saved you a few seconds. There's a boost. That music is almost ear splitting with the lightning. Maybe to save the banana. Didn't last long enough, I could have taken the shortcut. Should be an easy cakewalk. Not lose one, though. They're right behind me. DS Peach Gardens. This one just depends on the placement of the chain shops. You avoid them, you're good. Ah, lucky 
the shot. In the short way, just go around this. Ow! I left the road there momentarily, and they have got a boost jump. I'm guessing this is what's behind the castle. Never thought about it. There's one lap to put. You can go around that way, but there's really no point. And that's just a detour. This doesn't really do anything, it's just another direction you can take. That uh, must have been a POW block, I couldn't even see it. Words. There's two more races to go in the retro circuit. The next to last one is GameCube Nintendo's DK Mountain. The last track here that uses the cannon mechanic. And this is the animator of the cannon mechanic, so this is pretty cool. Oh, boy, man. That's really skinny. Why so mad now? Ah. Trying to avoid the ramp altogether. Didn't work out so well. That was like a hill with eyes on it, I couldn't tell. I get it, Steiny, you're there. That might be a volcano. The nice thing about the speaker on the Wii mode is you can hear every little bump it takes. Now this time 
Gotta avoid the ramp and hit the wall. I couldn't, couldn't run the red shell off on that one. Gotta pass wall -like. Good grief. Oh, he just didn't want that. King Boo, my nemesis. There we go, I got a good item. Triple bomb. <laughs> At that time, I ordered everything. track and we are finished. So hopefully this was enjoyable. I might do more let's plays in the future with the speedruns. Here's Bowser's Castle from the 64. Now this used to be a scary track and it's been toned down for the Wii. You'll see why when you get there. There's the statue that breeds fire. They're, these blocks used to have a voice. Now they just kind of linger. Even that one in the cage has been toned down. No matter. They're still as vicious as ever. They can still squash it. You know, it'll take a while. Instead of laughing, they just kind of Snickerage. Do a little courtyard here. Trying to save my mushroom. <laughs> I couldn't put it off too much longer. Very close to the end now. Spawns with very erratic patterns. Gonna try getting them to smash over there. Oh, that was close. Had a bad pattern to work with. peaceful part of the track right here is the bushes. The purple sky is kind of ominous, but it'll blend in after a while. A fire storm from the right side, so go to the left. 
break right here so we don't screw ourselves up and work out better. That's, the only, that's one of the only times you'll see me apply the brake when that's about to happen. It'll be very bad to get hit with a pow block in midair. Bad to get hit with one of those in midair too. Tile 4 doesn't do anything to your speed, it just try to drive on the red carpet for most of it. Hopefully you got him to stop early. And we are approaching the end of the retro circuit. Almost winning that one by a minute. And that's the end of the 50 cubic circuit, uh, cubic centimeter category. With gold in all the tournaments, at least a double star in every one of them. And we won't watch all of these the whole time, but. Do hope everyone enjoyed this, and there will be more, certainly. As the next videos will feature the 100 cubic centimeter category. First, the, the Wii categories, Mushroom, Fire Flower, Star, and Special. And then the Retro Cuts, which show Banana, Leaf, and Lightning. So thank you, everyone, for watching. Have a good evening or a good day wherever you're at. Peace.